So I just have to share some thoughts with you all. Um, I'm thankful for the YouTube channel. In case you don't know who I am, my name is Tamika C. Williams of Love Inspired Teach E. For one, I'm the creator, um, chief evolution officer, and I've been building a team. And um, I just added these to my workspace. And, oh, you know what I forgot to do? I forgot to clean the wall before I put them on. <clears throat> but I have more of the stickers to put up. But I've been working this morning, <clears throat> editing content, um, just ruminating on content, and also really thinking about what I've been learning because I've been participating in group coaching. And I have to say, I'm highly disappointed and sad that I left my accountability group. Um, I was also sold on the idea of an accountability group being a feature of the program I was in. And one of my favorite, favorite people in the group left. And once she left, I left. I told her I was thinking about leaving. And she thought I left already, and I didn't because I was trying to push through like they recommended. And luckily, I got these lashes on, so I'm not going to cry. But when I first listened, when I, when I first listened to her message, <clears throat> I'm sorry, I will get labeled emotional if I cry. So I always try to cut that off. Because even though I'm a human being, even though I'm a person, women especially get labeled. So I try to cut it as quickly and as I humanly can. And if you see me cry, you should know I'm hurting deeply, deeply if you actually catch me crying. I hate crying. And only since the pandemic and being involved in all these free summits with all these amazing motivational speakers have I been letting people see me cry in public. So please know I do not like to cry. I do not like to cry in public. I do not like to show my emotions. I like to show I'm cold hearted like the people who um, taught me how to be in corporate America. So I had to cut that. But anyway, I listened to um, this phenomenal coach's um, message to us as she did her graceful exit. And I was just kind of like, if she out, I'm out. I'm going to try to be graceful, but I'm not graceful like she is. But I'm out. And I was out. And I was one of the people who like, really, me and her both were like really, really pulling and trying to keep the group going. And, and and there was a few other people that did the same, but I connected with her. So good thing I have lashes on. I'm a fly away. I'm taking these suckers off soon. Just so y'all know, the glue really does bother me. Like I've got to find a better solution, but I do like them because they do add to my look, but they're not me. This is like... Like, I really, like, this is not me. Like, this is me doing the things that I learn in these groups. Like, this, let me show you me. This is me. With lashes on my hand and everything. This is me. I hope you like me the way I am. I love you guys. I'm going to get through this. If I don't, mm. Make sure you celebrate me. I'm one of those people. It'll be a celebration when God finally blesses me and tells me I learned my lessons. Whenever that may be. And remember, I posted it up. This is yet on May 27th, I think we're on now. Yesterday was the 26th, I do believe. May 27th, 2022. Tamika's will needs to be updated. But I'm saying my advanced directives... Should anyone ever have to make medical decisions for me because I'm incapacitated? Do not resuscitate. If I'm in an ambulance and you you need to tell them before they put me in, it's, she's a DNR. Love y'all. I'm just telling the truth. Out of love to inspire you to understand and learn for yourself so you can teach others so I can continue teaching you and so we can all evolve. Have a wonderful day. Mwah.